power steering response with the addition of what Mazda calls G-vectoring control. GVC monitors three parameters, vehicle speed, throttle position, and rate of steering wheel rotation. The technology momentarily diminishes engine torque in response to some steering inputs. The result is more precise initial turn in response and fewer mid-corner corrections. With extra reinforcement around the A-pillars and more high tensile steel used in the chassis, the new model's unibody also has torsional rigidity that's 16% higher, which benefits both handling and ride quality. Breaking the waves Kadama and his team also work to minimize the noises that penetrate the cabin. They used sound-absorbing materials to target specific unwanted characteristics that Kadama says increase passenger stress. After driving the new and old versions back to back, the new model seemed quieter and more refined. Inside, the new CX-5 is just as stylish as it is outside. The dash design is simpler and more elegant, it's flatter and more horizontal styling making the cabin feel wider and more spacious. The center display screen now perches atop the dashboard, so as to be easier for the driver to view. The seats, one of the few weak points of the outgoing CX-5, now provide better back support, especially in the lumbar area. The new seats support in three primary ways, from directly below, through the upper thighs, and against the shoulder blades. According to Mazda designers, these three focal points improve posture and reduce fatigue, and we found the new seats to be far more comfortable than those in the previous model. An updated version of Mazda's iActive Sense safety package includes automatic braking, driver attention alert, radar-based adaptive cruise control, lane keeping assist, lane departure warning, blind spot monitoring, and dynamic LED headlights. For the most part, these systems work as smoothly as they should, although we did experience one instance of overly aggressive braking by the adaptive cruise control. One thing that shouldn't change much with the new model is the pricing, with the starting range for the various trims expected to remain at $23,000 to $31,000. The new CX-5 builds on the achievements of its already impressive predecessor by gently evolving the crossover styling, driving experience, and interior design and refinement.